Hello everybody, my name is the Time Fox, and welcome to Hunger Games Simulator. This is a game that, well, it kind of explains itself, it is, it simulates the Hunger Games. So, I've set up a list. This is going to be Forever Red. So, the point, I'm, so, what did I set up here is a list of all of the Red Power Rangers who have ever been Power Rangers um, up to this day including um, only like uh, Rangers who have shown up for or a couple episodes um, so and which actually levels out in, because the, the amount they have is the 12 district there have been 24 Red Rangers so starting with uh, Mighty Morphin's Jason Lee Scott and then where he then passed the t torch on to Rocky DeSantos. When time was spun back and the alien rangers had to step in, Orico took their place as the red ranger from the alien, even though he was not the leader of the team and neither was Rocky. But then when Zeo happened, Tom Rocky was replaced and it became Tommy. He Tommy Oliver, everyone knows Tommy Oliver, if you are a Power Rangers fan, he was the green, he was the white, he was the red Zeo, he was the red Turbo for a time, um, he, and then he was the black Ranger, so, that, but then he went off to college and he, he passed the tor the Turbo Torch on to TJ Johnson, who was the next red Ranger of the Turbo and then TJ became blue when he teamed up with Andros, the Red Space Ranger. And then, and, um, what happened was a new whole new set of Rangers was formed. A, uh, the Power Rangers of the Lost Galaxy was led by their team leader, Leo Corbett. Who, but then back on Earth, Earth, the next season of Lightspeed Rescue was was headed by Carter Grayson, a fireman, and who then became the Lightspeed Rescue Red. Wesley Collins was chosen to be the Time Force Ranger in 2001 when the they came back from the year 3000. The other Rangers came back from the year 3000. So, and the only reason they chose him was because he had the same DNA as the previous Red Ranger from the future so his ancestor yada 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 next wild force the wild force ranger cole evans was given well yeah cole uh yeah he was given the wild force powers he was the last one to join the team as the other rangers were doing fine without him but he need they needed a fifth ranger and cole was chosen to to wield the force of the lion, the red lion sword. Then, in a secret ninja school, Shane Clark was chosen to be the red wind ninja ranger. Her, who then, back coming back around to the one of the greatest seasons of all time, in my opinion, um, Connor McKnight was the one to lead lead the Dino Thunder Rangers team alongside their mentor Tommy Oliver who is now um, a teacher their teacher in the future of 2025 Jack Landors the red SPD Ranger er, er, who then the then at the very end of the season passed his torch off to St Sky Taked who then passed his torch off to Bridge Carson, who became the Red Ranger in the episode, uh, the crossover episode of the net of two seasons from of two seasons after SPD, um, which was oh, uh, which was the. Operation Overdrive. The Operation Overdrive crossover did not have the previous team. They had a built pre-built team, but uh, Bridge Carson was the red SPD Ranger at the time. But then we went. But after that, and or technically before that, at 
Nick Russell, oh, oh, was the mystic force Red Ranger. He did not believe in magic at first, but soon he found himself believing and mainly being the star of almost every single episode. Because, you know, the plot revolved around him, mostly. Next, our robotic companion, our robotic Red Ranger, Mac Hartford, who was an android, or something. Um, but, for the most part, um, and then was turned human at the end. Casey Rhodes was the Jungle Fury Red Ranger. Or he was, yeah, Jungle Fury was good. Then, when the world seemed to end, uh, Scott Truman took the lead and became the leader of the RPM Rangers to defend Corp Corinth City. Okay. Two years later, er, er, when the Samurai Rangers emerged, Jaden Shiba showed up and took lead to form took lead of the team of Samurai Rangers, being the Red Samurai Ranger. While he was off doing other things that I know not of, because I don't watch that far, uh, Lauren Shiba, his sister, was the Red Ranger for a few episodes. But, then, going on to Megaforce, one of the worst seasons, and one of the worst Rangers ever. Yes, he was a pretty boy, Troy Burroughs. Not much character development. Not much of development at all. So yeah, Megaforce. Then, on to Tyler Navarro, who had a pretty compelling backstory in the third installment of the Dino installment of the Rangers. There's the Dino Charge Rangers. There's then, leading our second ninja team, the Ninja Steel team, was Brody Romero. Kidnapped as a child, he was brought into space, and then things, he came back to Earth and became a Power Ranger. I don't know, that's kind of all I know about him. So, now that we've be, we've done the sound off, so we've got our districts up here on the screen, This we are going to proceed. Okay, so as the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Tommy Oliver gathers as much food as he can. Go Tommy. Hey, who? Are you? Oh, by the way, leave a comment below who you think who you're rooting for to win for this. Um, so yeah, he gathers Tommy gathers as much food as he can. Casey runs away. Eh, he's a cat. He kind of runs away. Rocky grabs a backpack, but not realizing it's empty. Ooh, that sounds like Rocky. Cole Evans spears Mac Hardner in the abdomen. The funny thing is, so story time. Uh, you can read the rest while I'm talking, but this is the bloodbath we're going to start off with. Um, the actor who played Cole actually stabbed and killed his roommate. Um, so, I find that ironic. So, then it was Shane Clark runs to the cornucopia and hides... Scott runs away, because that's what he knows how to do. Uh, Orico runs away. Nick takes a spear from inside the cornucopia. Leo runs, and Sky runs. Bridge runs. Carter, Carter and TJ fight for a bag. Carter Grayson gives up and retreats. That doesn't sound like Carter at all. Jack takes a sickle from inside the cornucopia. Andrus runs away from the cornucopia. Laura and Sheba scares Wesley Collins away from the cornucopia. Mm, yeah, don't mess with the only female what Red Ranger. Brody Romero runs away. I don't know much about Brody, so we're gonna say yeah. Connor McKnight snatches a pair of size. Ooh. Jason Lee Scott runs away. OG Red Ranger running away. Wow, what does it say about the series? I didn't say that. I love the series. Jason Lee Scott runs away. I just said that. Jaden Sheba runs away. Yeah, he was kind of meh. Troy Burrows, Tyler Navarro, fight for bag, Tyler Murray, give us up and retreat. So, only one person died, I think. Okay, so day one. Leo Corbin scares, J Leo scares Jason off. Scott defeats Connor in a fight but spares his life. Bridge receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Casey makes a wooden spear. Jack begs for Carter to kill him. He refuses, keeping Jack alive. 
Well, Carter's a good Boy Scout. That's why he does that. Sky makes a slingshot. Lauren searches for water source. Jaden tries to spear fish with a trident. Troy receives an explosive. Ew, don't give Troy an explosive. He's pretty. He'll blow himself up. He's pretty, not smart. Um, TJ Johnson constructs a shack. Tommy Oliver sprains his ankle while running away from Tyler Navarro. Tommy sprained his ankle running from Tyler. Wow. Shane discovers a cave. Are you gonna have is it the cave to your secret ninja academy, Shane? Cole goes hunting, Brody makes a slingshot, Andrus goes hunting, Oracle goes hunting, Wes questions his sanity. Well yeah, he is, he's trying to win over a girl from the future. Whose distant relative proposed to her. Yeah, he's questioning his sanity. Nick Russell's discovers a cave. Rocky DeSantis searches for firewood. Cannon shots can be a heard in the distance. Mac Hartford's dead. One of the worst show ones, I, in my opinion, Operation Overdrive, except for that kind of crossover where it brought, um... Yeah. Brought one of the OGs back. Um, but, yeah. Mac, not that good. Night one. Bridge sets up camp for the night. Nick and Cole huddle for warmth. <laughs> okay. Casey and Sky tells uh, our stories that about themselves to each other. Brody looks at the nice guy. Troy quietly hums. He's pretty. I guess he can hum too. Leo strangles Jack with a rope. Oh, Leo. That is dark, man. Connor passes out from exhaustion. TJ defeats Tommy in a fight but spares his life. Well, that's good. We don't want OG, T OG Tommy Oliver. Or, more, or like OP Tommy Oliver, or defeated by his, his um, the guy who replaced him. Jason quietly hums. Tyler sets up camp for the night. Scott screams for help. You defeated ro armies of robot of Terminators, and you need to scream for help. Wesley Collin tends to his wounds. Andrew stays awake all night. Yeah, he's trying. He's probably still looking for his sister. You know. Jaden, Lauren, and Rocky sleep in shifts. Of course, the brother and sister would be together. Carter loses sight of where he is. Shane takes the woot, and Oracle screams for help. Next, day two. Wesley Collin bleeds out from untreated injury. Ooh, Wes! You should have used something from that future tech of yours to, you know. Connor steals from Sky. Why does that seem appropriate? Nick Nick overhears Casey and Lauren talking in the distance. Bridge constructs a shack. A shack? Bridge? Maybe. <laughs> Andrews diverts Carter's attention and runs away. Tommy shoots an arrow at Tyler but misses and kills Brody. It's okay, I don't know Brody that well, so go Tommy. Also, why are you using a bow and arrow? I thought that was, um... Ugh. Cat, not Katniss. Kimberly's th job. I thought that was Kimberly's job. Or, um... Or Cat. Or Cat. Or Catherine's job. Yeah, because she was also a pink ranger for a time. Rocky! Erico, Troy, and Cole raid Jaden's camp while he's, while he's hunting. Yeah, go fuck yourself, Jaden. TJ is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Shane searches for a water source. Jason stalks Scott, and Leo thinks about home. Which one? Earth or Maranoi or the space colony Terra Venture? Three cannon shots can be here. Jack, Wesley, and Brody. Shane passes out from exhaustion. TJ quietly hums. Troy and Lauren talk about the tributes to the live Scott. Passes out from exhaustion. Tommy cooks his food before putting his fire out. Rocky and Bridge talk about the tributes. Casey, Sky, Nick discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Leo tries to treat his infection. Orko, Tyler, Connor, and Cole sleep in shifts. Carter and Andros hold hands. <laughs> I ship it. I ship it. Jason and Jaden hold hands. I don't ship it. I don't ship 
OG with Samurai Boy. He's bad influence, Jason. Don't don't fall for it. Tyler Navarro camouflaged himself in the bushes. I mean, Dino Boy, he was found in the woods originally, so yeah. Connor collects fruit. Oracle defeats Scott, but squares his life. Wow, a lot of sparing today. No, not a lot of murdering. Uh, Bridge makes a spear. Or, Andrew starts to spear face with the trident. Leo picks flowers. Nice of you, Leo. Casey and Lauren work together. Nick receives an explosive. I, that's two for him now. No, wait. Sorry. That's one for him. Shane steals from Jaden. Well, he doesn't look good. He's a ninja. You, you, you don't. He, he could be looking, and you could have stolen from him. Carter practices his archery. Why? Tommy tries to spear fish. TJ runs away from Rocky. Why? Sky dies from hypothermia. Sky, my dude. You were the blue, then red, and then like in command of SPD. You die from hypothermia. Cole, Jason, and Troy hunt for other tributes. Troy's just there to be pretty. This guy's dead. Casey and Cole run into each other and decide a truce. Connor convinces Scott to snuggle with him. <laughs> I'll ship that one, too. Uh, Jaden destroys Nick's supplies. Fuck you, Jaden. Anyone... Because, you know, anyone with the name Jaden, you know, is... Uh, is obviously likable. You know. Because their name is Jade. You know, like Jaden Yuki from Yu-Gi-Oh! at GX. You know, a, character, a main character who's just... He, he's, he's so good that he can't lose, you know. So, Leo can't handle the circumstances and commit suicide. You were out in space for months. Fought all of that shit just to commit suicide? I'm disappointed in you, Leo. Jason goes to sleep. TJ tends to his wounds. Lauren and Tommy talk about the tributes to live. Oh, I, sh I can ship Lauren and Tommy. Bridge and uh, starts to fire. He's Bridge. We don't question it. And Rocky looks at a nice guy. Happy, Rocky? Mm, come on. Proceed. Proceed! Go! You guys see I'm clicking, right? There we go. Ugh. Day four. Shane diverts Troy's attention and runs away. Uh, he's a ninja! Tyler makes a slingshot. Tyler was... Yeah, Tyler's uh, Dino Boy. Connor kills TJ with a single. Ooh. Dino Thunder does not like car... Dino Boy does not like Car Boy. Lauren receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Tommy overhears Scott and Jason talking in the distance. Why wouldn't he go say hi? I thought Jason and Tommy were, you know, all good and stuff. Casey hunts her other tributes. Orko forces Cole to kill Jaden or Rocky. He decides to kill Rocky. Wow, Cole is killing people, you know, just like the actor. Too soon? Um, wow, Jaden's living this out. He's like, I am a samurai. I, am, I will commit suicide myself. Seppuku. Nick hunts for other tributes with his magic. Andrews fishes. Carter ambushes Bridge and kills him. No, not Bridge, my man. Leo's dead, TJ's dead, Rocky's dead, Bridge is dead. Casey, Scott, Connor, and Jason tell each other ghost stories to lighten... How does that lighten the mood? Jaden, Orko, and Shane track down and kill Troy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he was only surviving this much because of his looks, you know. He's not that skilled. Andros sets off an explosive, killing Cole and Nick. Your magic couldn't protect you, Nick, and your ability to talk to animals couldn't help you either. The squirrels weren't going to tell you. They were like, no, fuck you. You uh, you can understand us. Because, you know, squirrels, if you hear the squirrels, they'll plot to kill you. The wor they'll plot to destroy the world. Um, If you get the reference, 
uh, put a comment in below telling me what's from because I know what it's from. Carter begs Tyler to kill him. He refuses to keep it. Carter, like, why, Carter? Tommy thinks about home. Yeah, you think about Angel Grove. You. Day five. What a good show. You guys should check it out. Um, Casey tends to Scott's wounds. Jaden and Jason work together for the day. Tyler thinks about home. Carter receives a hatchet. Uh, Shane finishes. Connor thinks about home. Lauren searches for her. Andrews dies trying to escape the arena. Sounds like something Andrus would do. He would definitely try to escape. He wouldn't want to play. He wouldn't be one of forced to kill his friends. And Tommy repeatedly stabs Orko to death with sighs. Tommy. Are you evil green? Tommy. Five cannon shots can be heard in the distance. Troy Burroughs, District 11. Cole Evans from District 5. Nis Nick Russell from District 8. Andros from District 3. And Oracle from District 2. Tommy destroys Scott's supplies. Wow, Tommy's just lost it. He's gone Green Ranger mode. He's like, I gotta, I gotta do this for Rita, man. It's Rita. Uh, Casey de decapitates Connor. Oh my god. Using those kung fu skills to... Well, not really. I was about to say, Connor uses a sword, but no, Connor uses a staff. Lauren begs Carter to kill her. He refuses keeping her. Because Carter's a stand-up dude. He's not going to kill you. Even if you ask. Tyler receives clean water. Shane climbs a tree to rest. He's a motherfucking ninja. Of course he's going to do that. Jaden shoots an arrow into Jason Lee Scott's head. Jaden... Stop. We get it. You're a samurai. But you just killed the OG. The corner guppy is replenished with food supplies, uh, weapons, and memoirs from the tribute family. Cla Shane does not, does not go. Carter se severely slices Jaden with a sword. Finally, Carter, you did something good. Jaden's dead. Fuck you, Jaden. Tyler decides not to go. Lauren doesn't go. Tommy pushes Scott off cliff during a knife fight. Yeah, I'm rooting for Tommy. Casey falls into a pit and dies. Kung Fu, man. You know Kung Fu. Tyler, Shane, Carter, and Tommy hunt for the tribute. They hunt for Lauren, who's just built a shack. She's not that hard to find. She built a shack. Connor's dead. Jason's dead. Jaden's dead, finally. Scott's dead. Meh. Casey's dead. I'm disappointed in you. Tyler fends Shane, Clark, or Carter Grayson, and Lauren Sheba away from his fire. Tommy receives fresh food. We're down to the top five. Lauren tries to sleep through the entire Shane fishes. Tyler scares Carter off, and Tommy picks flowers. Probably for Kimberly. No cannon shots. Night seven. It's been a week. So Tommy fends Carter, tends to Carter's wounds. I ship it. Shane and Tyler tell stories, and Lauren receives her. Lauren, the only girl here. Tommy travels to higher ground. Shane begs to for Tyler to kill him. The ninja is asking for the Dino Boy to keep him all, to kill him, but he keeps him alive. Uh, Samurai makes a wooden spear, and Fire Boy discovers a cave. Tyler's woken by nightmares, probably because of his missing father. Lauren just, and Carter sleep in shifts. Okay, I can see it. Shane receives fast food from an unknown sponsor, and Tommy climbs a tree to rest. Go, Tommy. I'm voting Tommy. Uh, we're on top five now. Tell me who you you think is going to win, uh, who you want to win. Um, I'm, I'm voting for my boy Tommy because, you know, he's the best. Night nine. Tommy looks in the sky. Lauren starts a fire. Carter sees a fire, but stays hidden. Carter sees Lauren's fire. And Tyler silently snaps Shane's neck. Wow, Tyler. Digging for dino bones, you know. He is, um... Yeah. Tyler... Day 10. Tyler, Navarro, and Tommy Oliver fight Carter and Lauren. Carter and... Carter and Lauren... So, the fireman and the... Samurai beat the OG Green Ranger er, and the uh, the newest Dino Boy. It's probably Tyler. It was, if it was Tommy on himself, he would have... 
<laughs> now it's between Lauren and Carter. It's now between the two. Shane, Tyler, and Tommy are all dead. I'm disappointed. And Lauren Sheba, the samurai, accidentally steps on a landmine. The winner is Carter Grayson from District 4. The fire dude, fireboy, fireman survived. So let's take a look at the uh, placements here. Winner was Carter with four kills. Second was uh, Lauren with two kills. Tommy was three kills. In third, Tyler was in fourth with one. Shane was in fifth with one. You can stop and look for the rest of them. Let's see what we got. Uh, this is our summary. So if you guys want to read over it. No, no, no. Do, do, do. Okay, so that's a summary. Nope. So our placements are in last. We had Mac, which was good because he sucks. And then Jack from SPD. Wes. Brody. New guy, new guy, get to die sometimes. Sky, Leo, TJ, Rocky, Bridge, Troy, Cole, Nick, Andrus, Org, O'Connor, Jason, Jaden, Scott, Casey, and then Shane was fifth. Tyler was four. Or Tommy, blah blah blah. We just went through it. First was f District Four, then District Eleven, then District Two, then District Twelve, then District Six. The most kills was the winner, Carter Grayson, with. Four. Tommy had three. Lauren had two because she's a samurai. Jaden had two because he's a samurai. Address is a badass motherfucker from space, so he had two. Cole had two. Tyler had one. Orko had one. Casey had one. Leo had one. Connor had one. And Shane had one. So, thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, you can hit that like button down below. Uh, if you want me to do this again, I have another... I have a villain list. Um, I have a villain list. I have the... The henchmen list, like the foot soldiers that those villains lose, um, use. Um, I have a list of all the females and uh, all the girls, like all the girls ever. Power Rangers, because they all fit into kind of one. Because there's like one or two girls per thing, you know. They all, it, it squares up. It, it all adds up. So, um, when, all in all... I thought that was pretty good. Cart, my boy Carter won. I like Carter. He's he's stand up guy. Uh, he did his team out. Uh, the the season he was from was good. Um, if you guys know more about Power Rangers, I love Power Rangers. Um, if you guys want to talk to me about Power Rangers, you can uh, hit me up. Uh, I think some of my stuff is in the stuff in descriptions and such. Um, leave comments, yada, yada, yada. Um, now, next is the thing that we have to do. Okay, Duck. So, our winner today. A winner today is one of mum ba ba ba. Gotta wait for it to load. Do 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 do. Um, no thanks. Um. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, uh, shout out goes to Dipper today. Dipper has been subscribed to me for two years. Yes, thank you, Dipper. I think I did a shout out for you already. Well, that's the way the dice roll. Uh, dice roll chose Dipper. Thank you, Dipper, for being subscribed. I hope you'll enjoy this video. Um, I hope you enjoy the Hunger Games series. If you guys have any other... Hunger Games simulates we want to do, um, say, Overwatch is another one I was thinking about doing. Um, Overwatch, Marvel characters, that's a big one. Marvel versus DC. DC in general, villains, heroes, pr Disney princesses. That'd be interesting. I'll get working on that one right now. Um, Anything, just leave a comment. Tell me what you guys want me to do for the Hunger Games simulator. Who you want to see fight to the death. 
and tell me who you guys want wanted to win. Tell you who you thought who didn't get to see to win. Uh, are you happy with Carter winning? I am. I'm. I mean, Tommy was came in third, and he he's OG. He's out of practice. Uh, Carter's still in practice because he's a fireman. You know, he saves lives. He's not supposed to take them, but he does what he can to survive. Carter, 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 yada, yada, yada. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye. Oh, you're still here. Well, if you want to be added to the subscribers list, it's to possibly be shouted out in one of my next videos. To add yourself to the subscriber list, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button down below. Uh, it's easy as that. Um... Enough said. I will roll. I roll every video uh, with a pair of dice, depending on how my subscriber list has been updated or not. Um, and as soon as you got it are added to the subscriber list, you will be one of many possibilities to get a shout out. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, I'm the Time Fox. Peace out. Bye bye.